There's a new tool to help law enforcement locate some of our most vulnerable seniors. Uh, just like an amber alert, a silver alert puts out notifications that a person over 60 years old with dementia or Alzheimer's is missing. And KXY 4's Ali Norton working for you tonight. And Ali, this uh, has not yet been used in Spokane. Uh, thankfully, no, Nadine. The silver alert was signed into law by Governor Inslee in June. It was used for the first time on Friday, but that was on the west side. Those who have loved ones who suffer from memory loss hope the system never has to be used, but knowing it's there gives them a sense of security. Places they've gone all their lives, they can drive there and get lost. It happened to uh, my mother-in-law. Christy Amons remembers the day her late mother-in-law with dementia lost her way. She traveled maybe, maybe 10 miles, not far. A routine trip to the dentist for Charlotte turned into a big scare for the whole family. I had been a, a patient there for 50 years and all of a sudden she didn't know where she was. The Amon family is one of the lucky ones. Charlotte stopped a police officer for help, but there's been others that haven't returned home. This new silver alert system could be a game changer. Just another tool for law, all law enforcement to use to help find missing, um, missing adults. If a person 60 or older with dementia or Alzheimer's is reported missing, reader boards on highways light up with info. Trooper Jeff Sevigny says this makes it so anyone passing could potentially aid in the search. So this really helps us get the information out to the public um, so they can be our eyes and ears out on the street. Eamon's mother-in-law has passed, but now she and her husband own Home Instead Senior Care. They provide assistance to 40 seniors, some with dementia and Alzheimer's. While she hopes the system doesn't need to be used, she feels better knowing it's there. I feel like there's a chance that you can find my mother or my father before something serious happens to them. Along with being displayed on DOT reader boards, there will also be highway advisory mess radio messages. It will not show up on televisions or send push notifications on cell phones like Amber Alerts do. In the studio tonight, I'm Allie Norton, KXLY 4 News.